reload. All right, so the plan is now to jump out of the truck and just kind of walk around these ponds, see if we can bullets on something. What's your smell? Get him! Get him, boy! Oh, there, see, there goes one. I just spooked the dove up. So anyways, the plan is to walk around this, these ponds and the doves are like hunkering down, so I'm thinking once we spook them, Spook them out of the thick stuff, we can uh, actually get some more. I brought Bullet with me to sniff the, sniff the doves out when I shoot them because they are hard to find in these things, in these uh, pepper tree bushes. Yeah, these suckers are camouflage. What do you think, old man? Where's he at? I don't know. It seems like there was tons of doves in here the other day. Now they're being kind of there's not as many. I don't know if I'll be able to get my limit or not. Stay tuned, we'll just keep trying. Come on, let's go. There goes one. Get bullet on me. Charge. It's just the stuff you gotta find them in. Oh my gosh. Let me see if I can find them. Good job, Billy. Hey, good boy. Found one. Bullet actually found it. There's another one in there. I gotta find. Come on, Bullet. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Find that bird. Where's that bird? Find him. Find him, bullet. Where's he at? There he is. There he is. Get him, boy. Get him. Good boy. I gotta remember to zoom out, bullet. Get him. There. Good boy. I don't think we'll have a problem limiting him out. Just, just takes time. Let's go get some more. This dove was on to me. He flew off before I could even get a shot on him. I just shot a, I shot a dove, I didn't get it on camera, but I just wanna show you how hard it is to find these things. And these uh, pepper brush trees. 
Pepper trees. I don't know why I said pepper brush trees. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Get in front. Come on, let's go. Go find that bird. Go find that bird. Let's well, it really isn't a retrieving dog. He just kind of helps me sniff them out. Where's that bird? Get that bird. I don't know why. He just won't pick them up and retrieve them. He's in there. He'll go Get find him. them, though. Come on, Bullet. Where's that bird? Find that bird. Find that bird. Where's he at? Smell him out. Find that bird. Where's he at? Where's he at, boy? Where's he at? Good boy. You find him? Good boy. I think you found him. Where's he at? Where's he at? Show me. Show me where he's at. Good boy. He's in there. Oh, you're so close. Oh, good boy. You found him. There he is, boy. There he is. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. He found him. He can't get him. That's a good boy. All right, come on. You can come out. Come on. <laughs> See if you can get out of there. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, what a good boy. You found a bird. Stay there. I'll get him. I mean, he is. There he is, anyways. <clears throat> That's good boy. See? Good boy. That's good puppy. Good job. Golly, and these pepper trees, they, uh, you think you move them out of the way, but they whip you and they stick you in the eye every freaking time. I got stuck in the eye earlier looking for this one. But we're going to have some tacos. Old dove. Come on, let's go find that bird. Good boy. That one. Oh, it's so hard to find him in here. Find that bird. Find that bird. He's in there. Find him. Oh, I think I see him. I'll get him, bullet. I don't want you to get up in there. This stuff is such a pain. Ow, ow, ow. There he is. I see him. I got him, bullet. He dropped straight down. This stuff just sucks. That was an easy one to find. Hey, good boy. Hey. We said we. Good job. Oh, there goes one. I think I need to walk around this trail. Maybe I'll do a little walk around this uh, this pond here. Stay tuned. down. Another one down, boys and girls. All right, I think that's gonna do it for the dove hunting. I'm gonna head on home and get these suckers cleaned up and make some, uh, make some, golly, make some dinner with them. Here you go, buddy. Mmm. Take this out there with me while I clean them ducks. Or, uh, ducks. Clean them doves. And I need a knife. I don't know where anything is. This, that, and I think that's all I need. All right, so as long as I clean this without showing any blood i think i should be fine on youtube but i don't want to get get the video demonetized but um 
with doves it's super easy if you just want to breast them but I'm gonna I'm gonna pluck a couple of them a few of them so I can keep them whole and I kind of want to maybe fry some up but uh their skin is so their skin's like paper so all you gotta do is find that part and just rip their uh rip their skin right off the breast just taking his uh his jacket off a little bit but all right and then uh you can't help the feathers. There ain't nothing you can do about that. And I'll just like fold the wings back and whatnot. Grab your knife. Cut kind of inward toward the breast. And you just come uh, outward. Just follow that bone. Oh, there's blood. Dang it. Demonetized. Oh well. And then you just come around here and basically it. Probably just rip it all the way off now. Bam. Give it a little rinse. A freaking table came apart. So what you're left with. Alright, I showed you one, so I'm just gonna do the rest real quick and uh, <clears throat> I'll show you how I pluck them. So there's nothing really on the wings. I mean, you can leave the wings on if you want, but there's literally nothing. Cut that off. Cut another one off. And uh, just start plucking. They're so easy to pluck. Snips, cut those off, uh, cut the head off. And then what I do is just split it down the backbone. Yeah, cut down along each side of the spine. You can rip the spine right out and then all the entrails come out. And then uh, just rip out the guts from the back. That's it. All right, bullet. They're all cleaned up, boy. These ducks are hungry. All right, this is what I what I got. So I cleaned. I just plucked a few of them. Some better. Uh, I'm not exactly sure. I think I'm just going to fry these. Fry three of them and then the rest I'm going to put in tacos. You want to bag them up and let them chill for a little bit because I'm not ready to eat yet. <clears throat> Actually, probably ought to... I got to run up to the store and grab the rest of the ingredients because I don't have them on hand. So I'm going to run up there and grab those real quick. Alright folks. Cleared up. Uh, just made it back from Publix, and uh, I'm gonna get get things started here. Dove jalapeno popper tacos. I'm gonna cheat a little bit. You don't usually put onion, but I'm just gonna use an onion. I'm using an onion for this recipe. And if you think you want to try it out, so chop up one onion or half an onion. Once you get that chopped up, throw it in the pan. Let that uh, cook down. Use one. Use a couple. 
jalapenos. It seems like when you cook them real good, the jalapenos, it kind of, it uh, tones them down a little bit. When you cook down the jalapenos, it tones them down from the heat. So they shouldn't be, if you cook them pretty good, they won't be super spicy. I think a lot of people have trouble with the jalapeno poppers when they put them on the grill because it doesn't really get a good char on them. So when they come out, they're freaking, uh, unbearably hot and they can't even enjoy the the popper and while this is cooking down uh, get the bacon prepared cook like hmm do this way one oil Alright, so five strips of bacon. Put the oven in, or put the oven in the bacon. Put the bacon in the oven. I want that start cooking. So once this is all cooked down, which is probably about there. I'm going to take this off, put it in a bowl, put it to the side. <coughs> Ooh, the sucker's spicy. Put it to the side and uh, start cooking. I'm gonna slice up that dove meat. I'm just gonna cook the breast. I'm not gonna fry that. I'll save the rest of that. I'll save those. Uh, save those doves that I plucked for later. But for now, I'm just gonna. This thing's all crooked. For now, I'm just gonna cook up the uh, the breast that I cut out. Keep an eye on this. Oh, it's a little oil in there with it. It's a wee bit of oil. There we go. So we got the, the dove, dove breast. I'm just gonna use some garlic salt, lorries. Just give them a little, little dust. Nice little, not too much. It either. Damn, that was good. Okay. All right, I just pulled the bacon out, so I'm just gonna set it up on the cutting table, cutting board. Can you see it? So there's uh, crispy bacon. I mean, look at that stuff. It came out freaking perfect. The oven's the way to go. Mm. Basically. Oh. So, it's not like too crunchy, but it's cook bacon however you want. It's the, oh man, you can't. Freaking perfect. I've never, this is the first time I've ever made, this idea has been in my head for quite a while and uh, Pretty excited to try it. 
So to assemble your taco, get you some, let's see if you can see any cream cheese. It's a healthy dollop. Try to keep it in the middle, I would think, because it's going to try to melt. Got a big spoon. Get uh, some meat. Jalapenos and onion. Dude, come on. This is going to be... And top it off with your bacon. Panini press it for a few seconds. I'm not gonna leave it on there too, too long because I don't want the cheese to all melt out. But. Oh, jalapeno, it's got a nice little kick to it. And there you go. Make three more of these real quick, or two more of these, and I'll let you know how they come out because. Uh, I think they're gonna come out pretty amazing. All right, I can't wait. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna eat this one and eat this one and tell you how it is, and then that's gonna wrap up the episode. That's an amazing way to make a taco. Everything's cooked proportionally. Mmm. Here we go. Alright folks, that's gonna do it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Like and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.